hi guys welcome back to my channel um if you're new here my name is Rhoda or you can call me Wayua and if you're returning asante asante sana i truly appreciate um on today's video you can see i'm on a different setting i'm in my kitchen um i just want to uh, it's not really a makeover but i just want to spruce things up just to track things a little and just give the kitchen like a fresh look i'm going for black and silver silver so you just see that a lot across the area it's a small small kitchen but it serves the purpose so yeah without further ado let's get started i'll start with the before i'll show you the before it's a mess and <laughs> we'll do the after this is what you're working with so that's the area that i want to change there the upper cabinets and the lower cabinets and then there's that um it's not too bad but yeah this is the area that i want to change the most i don't know it's just what is this and then that's the area the other area the sink area my god terrible i want to change that as well and then the other part that annoys me is this area let me move at the back it's that part over there below the table i want to get rid of all those bags and everything else that is there and then we'll see how it goes now the rest is just the nini it's my fridge that it's not necessary so that's the before that we are working with that's the before that you're working with so yeah let's wait for the after um, so first i'm going to start by transferring these spices into this jars spice jars so these are just few of the spices that we use a lot so i want to put them here i have my labels here and the and the labeling pen um hmm. i don't want the i don't want the labels to be seen so i'm trying to figure out <laughs> But this is magnetic. I don't know how. I'm... Let me just see how I'm going to maneuver around it. Oh, my pen, my pen went dry. Okay, I've had this for a while, so I think I need to get a new pen. So these are not going to work.
guys i'm basically done nothing much has changed i've just tracked a little things here and there so i wanted to show you the final reveal for now um so yeah this is how it's looking forgive that this is the ring light um cable so once you get there then you come like that with that corner that's where i have put my spices my teas and everything else so i can tell you i got this this um this cutting I used to put the tea leaves it was supposed to be a spice job but I, I only put it put my tea leaves here. Um I got it from House of Never, it was going for six hundred bob. Um and I find it very nice. I only take two types of tea. I take lemon and lime and lemon and ginger. So I just sort of arrange them there so that it's easier to get them and I place them here on top of them. Then from the microwave, there is the coffee maker that's on that that corner. I'm not sure if you can see it. And then next, next to it, is a as you saw, I put um I put the vinegar and the olive oil, and then on this spice rack that sounds like that is when I got from the the oil and vinegar thing. I got it from also of it was going for five hundred. These spice jars that are magnetic, I got them from Tiles and Carpet. So I've just put the spices that we use the most. This is the water in me kettle. And I love how that corner looks like right now. Then from there, we move to this corner. Mm -hmm. We move to this corner. So I changed the dish rack. This dish rack, I got it from Kamukunji. Uh, it's they say it's stainless steel. I'll see as time goes by if it is. So I put my the dry plates and the cups over there. Um, also change these things, these spoon holders. I change them to these ones that I got from Tales and Carpet as well. And then as you go to that corner, there's that dish rack. That one is for putting now um, utensils that have just been washed before they dry. Then from that, uh, so I think that area looks okay. Then now there's the sink area. I'm sure you're gonna see, but I changed that kind of thing for putting that one I got from Kamukunji, and this is the stop up sink, whatever mini that I put. So yeah, that's it for that corner. I need to change those. I need to change these kitchen towels for wiping. I need the microfiber one. I'm gonna I'm going to look um at Kafo. Okay guys, I love food. Just thought I should mention the ECU Chafu. This is glue that was put there because the sink was starting to come apart. So this is the last part that I this is the last part that I decluttered. I put some flowers there, I moved the dish rack that was there, moved it here just to put the um fruits and vegetables and then I put the the clutter that was down there. What are they called? Those paper bags. I put them over in that bin just to make the whole place look a bit presentable. And I think I like it. And yeah, let me let me know what you guys think. So that's that's that area, that's the sink area, that's the utensils area. I really love this dish rack. I'm just hoping that it's not going to rust. And then there's this area for my small spices. And that area for my tea and the blender and everything else. I said, if not, this wire is on for the ring light. Yeah. And that's it. So, yeah, that's it for my video, guys. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you think. Let me know if there's any 
not so much as that you can see but i really love the clutter free kitchen right now it's what i wanted to achieve and i'm happy i got to achieve that thank you so much for watching please if you haven't subscribed please subscribe share with your friends and let's grow this family i know we can thank you and god bless you